What's up, everybody? It's Ken here with Binary Pro Strategies. This is going to be a uh, weekly uh, recap of the trades that I made this week. The week ending on August 23rd of 2019. And uh, we're going to look at it. And I also have some new stats I'm interested in uh, sharing with you guys as well. But um, as you can see, this was a fairly average week, 3,600. These are just my trades. And um, also, when I'm trading, I'm only trading one or two patterns. I do uh, share a total of five different patterns, and I'm only trading uh, two of those patterns. Okay, um, and it's not to say that um, you wouldn't have good results trading the other patterns. It's just that it's um, there's so many signals that come in here. You kind of have to pick or choose what you like. I particularly like these particular two patterns, and this these are the ones that I trade. So sometimes I'll change that up and maybe start trading another pattern but in most cases I have one or two patterns that I pretty much stick with and um, and that's what I do also understand that these kind of results you know I'm trading um, pretty much all day I'm, I'm here at night from 7 to 9 I'm in the morning from uh, 8 to 3 p.m. Uh, central time uh, this is not the way I recommend people trade I recommend um, that you come in you hit your objective uh, either first thing in the morning or in the evening, then stop trading. Uh, I'm here trading all day. I am going to change that eventually because honestly, it's it's hard to uh, it's hard for me to get things done, trading as much as I do and working with students. So I'm going to start cutting my hours back in the morning. I'm only going to be in chat for a couple hours in the morning, and then I'll be in, in chat a couple hours at night. So still plenty of time to uh, to. Uh, show my trades to you, uh, discuss them, explain the, the setups and so forth. Uh, but uh, that's not going to happen. I'll still continue to be in chat all day for right now. But probably in a month or so, I'm going to cut that back so I can spend more time during the day working with my students and uh, give a little bit more attention to, to helping everybody understand what's going on here and understanding all the setups and why they are and so forth. So anyhow, as you know, for the last few weeks, I've been sharing... Uh, what I call the first trade win. That means at the end of the session, I go back and I ask myself, was the first trade, was it a win or a loser? I look at my results and I post that. So in most cases, I can have a win on the very first trade. Uh, as you can see this week, there was only one session out of 10 where I actually had my first loss, which was the first trade of the day. Besides that, everything else, the very first trade of the day was a winner. So I hit at 90%. Goes back to... What I've been talking about is you can usually hit your objective early in the morning and then get out. Okay, so whatever that objective is, um, you come in. I usually prefer to do increments of 50. So whether you're doing 100 or 200, 300 a day, whatever that objective is, come in, hit that objective and stop trading. Don't, don't trade all day. You don't really need to do that. Okay, and you don't need to trade at night and during the day. You could trade just uh, if I had my preference, I would just trade at night or there are certain times during the day that are better than others, but, um, you know, that's really a totally new video. So, anyhow, um, good week overall. Um, now, these are the percentages. Now, this is the percentages of just one of the patterns I trade. Not both, just one of the patterns that I trade. And I call them naked trades because not using, I do track all these. It doesn't mean I trade every single one of those. But the purpose of this is to say, okay, if I just traded it without looking at EOM, if I traded it without having any kind of uh, long or short bias, I tend to be a, um, I prefer shorts over buys. There is a reason for that. But uh, without even looking at any of that, I said, okay, if, if you just came in here and just blindly took the signal, it says buy, you buy it. Uh, it says sell, you sell, and that's it. Considering nothing else, which I don't recommend that you do, by the way. But if you did... Still some really high percentages here. Um, you know, these numbers really surprise me um, in the sense that, <clears throat> you know, when I trade, I'm always looking at EOM. I'm looking at other things. But if if I didn't, I mean, the percentages are still very good. So this gives you, um, I like it because even if for some reason the EOM, for some reason, dies off and you're still trading, I mean, the percentages are still there to show that you're still going to be okay. All right. Um, and I broke it down based on morning session and evening session. Once again, this is just this week. This is not total, okay, because they vary a little bit week by week, right? Um, so uh, you could see, obviously, in the evenings, Aussie, Euro hit an 82%, 82% on the pound, and then you come over here to the end, 70%. But look what, look what the end did during the day, 76%. 
Okay, these are overall stats, 76, 75, 68, almost 70% there, 73. Folks, those are really good stats. Um, just looking at uh, a single pattern, trading it blindly, um, I'm very happy with those kind of numbers. I mean, that goes to show you the how powerful these patterns are, and they are powerful. And um, so anyway, uh, the key is, once again, is not to trade these naked. Uh, I do show you how to use EOM. I do show you how to look for certain kind of bias in the market. But anyway, all those things, you throw in EOM, you throw in, uh, you know, market bias, you're going to obviously have better results. But that's a great starting point looking at those kind of percentages. Okay, so what I did this week is <clears throat> I went to, did a screenshot of just the evening trades. My favorite is the Euro US. So I'm just going to show you the Euro US for the whole week. This is Sunday night. Uh, as you can see for the Euro, I think there was one, two, three, four, five, six trades just on the Euro, only one loser. Um, you don't have to trade a lot to hit an objective. Okay. Um, you don't have to trade every, you don't have to trade through the whole night. Once you hit your objective, whether it's on the first, second, third, or fourth trade, you're done. Okay. You don't have to trade for two hours every night. Uh, in most cases, I can get out, as you see, when I make my first trade, I can usually hit my objective within the 30, first 30 minutes to an hour. And then I'm, you know, that's the way I like to trade. Okay. Um, but anyway, so, I mean, that was a really, really nice Sunday night. Also, Sunday nights are my favorite time to trade, but any time at night is good, okay? Nights are just, as you could see from those prior stats, nights are just a really good time to trade. All right, so this is going to be on the, well, this is going to be the 20th. Don't have, I don't know what happened to the 19th, but this is on 20th. Um, once again, you could see here I had what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. But look how many losses I had. One two, three. So in this case, you're looking at a little bit better than 50%. Still a profitable night um, on, uh, this was two, This was Tuesday night, yeah. Still a profitable night on Tuesday. Uh, once again, you don't have to have really high probability trades to make money. Um, you'll see on Friday, if, I'll show those numbers again here in a minute, but uh, Friday was my strongest day, and I think the overall percentage was only like 54%. So it's kind of, I don't know what that is. I, one thing I do know is that the key here is how you adjust size. So, um, you can't just come in trading binaries and expect to just trade onesies and make money. You have to be able to adjust size. There are certain times when you want to put on more contracts and there's times when you don't want to put on more contracts. And I teach you that. And that's what, um, gave me a really nice Friday, which Fridays are tough as it is, but, I was adding size at the right time. Um, I was really disciplined and it paid off. Even though the percentages weren't there, it still paid off because I managed my size correctly. Okay. All right. So let's see here. <clears throat> okay. This is, I think this is the 20, yeah, this is the 21st. This is Wednesday night. Once again, I mean, a lot of had, you know, we had some losses in here, but you know, you come in the first thing in the morning, you trade, you're going to make money. That's the way I like to do it. Uh, we had some losses in here. Um, but overall, I had a lot of wins. So good night. A lot of activity uh, for for nighttime. I mean, typically, I'm only seeing five or six per pair. In this case, they had a lot of them. It doesn't mean I traded every single one of these. Once again, these are all naked. Uh, these are all naked um, positions. So it doesn't mean just because that said the sell here that I sold here. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. Uh, it just depends on what the EOM is. If the EOM is good in here, then uh, that I'm going to be taken. Otherwise, I'm going to let some of these go. So you lose some wins, you lose some losses, but overall, um, you get more wins when you use the EOM filter. All right, so let's see if we have Thursday. Yep, okay, this is just going to be Friday then. This is Friday during the day. Once again, Friday stats were not really that good on Friday. You can see a lot of losses here. Uh, there's loss, 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 but I wasn't trading through a lot of this. I didn't trade a lot of yen on Friday, okay, because the EOM wasn't good all day. So um, I really watched that EOM on Friday, and uh, I ended up having one of my best days for the whole week, okay? So once again, the lesson to be learned here is that, yes, percentages can help you a little bit, but it doesn't mean that you can't make money with something that's only, say, even 50% right, okay? 
Um, it's how you manage size. That's the real secret to uh, to trading these binaries. It's not that you have a system that makes 90% winners. You have to know when to put size on. And that's what I teach you, how to put size on when you're trading. <clears throat> so anyway, that's it. Uh, that's going to be the recap for this week. Sorry about my throat. Just having a little allergies this week. So I'm not, I can't talk very good. But anyway, um, if you like these videos, always please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe. You'll be on the, the list here to get any kind of new videos that I'm putting out. I did put one out a couple weeks ago. I do have more coming out. Some educational uh, videos that are going to be free. I'll put those out for everybody. Hopefully, they'll help you out a little bit in your trading. And um, any questions, comments, please leave them below. I'll come back later and answer those for you. Or if you need to get a hold of me, you can always go to my website, binaryprostrategies.com. And uh, there's contact information there. And uh, also, if you want to get on my uh, mailing list, I do send uh, these reports out with the charts as well um, via email. But I need your email address in order to do that. So if you just do that, provide me with the email address on the website. I'll make sure that you get up to date on uh, on all the uh, my latest results. Plus, get a copy of these charts as well. So it's nice to have. Anyway, okay, that's it. Um, we'll be back next week. I'm expecting because of what I saw on Friday, I think we're going to end up having a really good week next week. I think we're going to see a lot of volatility, a lot of, there's a lot of news in the market. Uh, volatility is a two-edged sword. You, um, there's ways to play it and there's ways not to play it. So, um, and you can tell by just what kind of signals we're getting, how often we're getting them and whether they're winning or losing. So, uh, I always kind of, just always start off with ones. I never start off with size, and then I will add size. If things are going good, then I can add size and make my day. But anyway, um, that's it. We'll see everybody next week. I hope everybody has a great trading week, and uh, we'll do our next week. Um, next Saturday, I should have it out. Y'all take care. Okay, so if you're interested in learning exactly how I do this, I do offer uh, two different packages. And the way this is set up is that uh, if you want to learn about the core strategy package, now that isn't going to include uh, all the videos. You're going to get full access to all my training videos and educational material. You're going to get uh, full disclosure of the core strategy, which I use a lot, particularly the single and double continuation patterns. The majority of all the results that you see uh, on my uh, daily uh, returns is going to be based off of those two patterns okay I also do trade uh, the Delta pattern and I also uh, will show you how to use the nibble strategy the nibble strategy is designed to catch very short-term trades and and I'll show you exactly how to use that in combination with uh, some of the other other core patterns uh, also, how to transition from demo to a live account. This is very important. Uh, that video is also included. As you know, it's also available on YouTube for free. But uh, how to transition from a demo to, to a demo to a live account is very important. Something you need to watch. Don't just jump in and start trading in a live account. You want to learn the strategy and you want to uh, make sure that you're profitable. I'd say at least nine out of every 10 days. And then when you get ready to transition to a live account, please watch the video because there's some good, really good steps on how to uh, to make that transition. Also, when you purchase the package, you're going to get a one hour personal uh, training with me. So you and I will do a one on one and I'll make sure that you fully understand uh, everything and how it works. Now, this package is designed to pretty much uh, purchase and go if you'd wish. You can purchase, uh, watch everything and go out and trade on your own. Now, if you want to learn about the core strategy, uh, plus the crystal ball, basically you're getting everything in here. You're getting the core strategy, but, you, but, but you're also going to get the, uh, you're going to learn the crystal ball method. That's something that's available. That's uh, a video that is not available online. That's something you and I will once again sit down and go through and make sure you fully understand it. Now, if you decide that you want to go just with the core strategy and learn the crystal ball at some point, I'll just charge you the difference between uh, the core strategy price and then the full price that includes uh, the crystal ball. So I'll just, change, I'll just charge you the difference between the two. Okay, so these are designed to basically uh, purchase, learn them, and then go and do your own trading and so forth. Now, if you wish to... Um, Join me live as I trade live every day, which I highly suggest. 
because what I do is I also not only do I share my charts but I show you where I'm getting in where I'm getting out what strike what price why I'm doing it what I'm seeing in the market uh, it's well worth it um, and that's only gonna be fifty dollars okay so if you want to uh, once again if you just want to learn these on your own you can purchase the packets and move on if you want to uh, learn the package and then also uh, join my live uh, trading room chat room then that's just fifty dollars a month and that's fifty dollars reoccurring as long as you want to stay there's no time limit so if you want to stay two months three months a year whatever it doesn't matter it's just fifty dollars a month okay so if you're interested you want to go to binaryprostrategies.com and uh, in there under join now you're uh, click on that little button it'll pop up you'll see this and you can go ahead and purchase uh, one of these um, one of these two packages and or if you're a reoccurring member you can go ahead and join the monthly if, if you're not already part of the uh, of the chat room so any questions as always you can always get a hold of me via by going to the website my phone numbers there email address uh, and so forth so if you like to do that feel free to give me a call I'll be glad to answer any of your questions before you make a decision but everything I teach is fully disclosures I'm not holding anything back I am here to educate I'm not a signal provider that doesn't do you any good by me just giving you my signals I'm here to teach you how I see the signals and I want you to learn them as well and be able to identify them um, as well as I do and then you know this way you are free to uh, to trade on your own you don't need me around all the time but uh, for those that like to stay in the chat room and and trade with us live every day that's always an option as well so that's it uh, thanks once again for watching my video and you'll have a great day